you're looking at the history of the iPad. Five generations from the very first iPad to the newest one, the iPad Air. Every year, they've upgraded them. They've upgraded the power. They've upgraded the design. But how fast is the newest iPad Air, really? And how does it compare to the beginning of the iPad? First test, starting up the iPad. We got all of our fingers positioned at the start buttons, and we want to thank Apple for not moving the start button. And as we expected, the fastest startup time was with the iPad Air, which is running with the A7 chip. One of the most common tests with the iPad is browsing the web, so we tested it. Got everybody set with Mashable.com in Safari, fingers over go, hit it at the same time, it popped into the iPad Air. In the iPad Air, it's the first one to have a MIMO Wi-Fi antenna, which is multiple in, multiple out. What does that mean for you? It's faster. People love to watch video on their iPads. They love to watch YouTube videos on their iPad. We love to watch Mashable's own five facts on the iPad. So of course, that's what we tested out. This was one of our favorite tests because we got YouTube, the YouTube site open on all five iPads at once, hit the video playback, and immediately you could see iPad Air handled it the fastest and best. iPad first generation was the slow poke. You know what's frustrating about the iPad? When you want to shut it down, and it takes forever. So going back in time, we looked at the iPad, the first iPad, all the way to the iPad Air. Guess which one shut down the fastest? Of course, the iPad Air.